Phillips bringing big data to healthcare. Welcome to WSJ Live. I'm Simon Constable, and we're lucky enough to have the CEO of Royal Phillips here. He's Franz van Hoyten. Thank you very much for being here. And today, you announced the formation of a new business group within the healthcare division of, of Royal Phillips. Tell us about it. Yeah, that's right. We see that uh, there is an explosion of data mm. in healthcare. There will be more data about individual patients, their vital signs. We have all the data from, for example, MRI scans and mm. CT scans. Then we have pathology, where we take samples from tissue, and that will provide a lot of data. And then we have the constant monitoring of patients as they are treated. Now, all of that gets to the healthcare providers, and it kind of overwhelms them. While at the same time, there's a huge promise of making healthcare better. So what we will do with our healthcare informatics solutions and services is to make sense out of all the information that confronts the healthcare providers. And, and when, when you're saying healthcare providers, you, you mean the doctors and nurses doctors that, who, and you, nurses, who yeah. you go to. And quite often, I think we've all had this experience, you go to the doctor and the doctor has an idea of, of how he wants to treat you no matter seemingly what the disease is. Now, I exaggerate just a little bit, but it does seem that way, you know, take two aspirin and go away or, you know, it, it just seems very generic and you say this can help you with that so you get all the data how do you how do you slice and dice that yeah. down so that the doctor says it isn't take two of these it's take, take 16 of those and then do this and this and it's just for you well, of course for for many years healthcare has improved through the application of standard protocols and procedures mm -hmm. and, and that's logical because it builds on the years of experience but with increasing effectiveness of diagnostics, mm. uh, such as in, in, in the radiology department, in the pathology department, as well as in patient monitoring and even genomics, then there is a rich analysis possible on the individual, mm. allowing personalized medicine for the first time. In our business, we will focus on clinical informatics and algorithms to assist the doctors and the nurses to take the right decisions. Mm. It will also help hospitals to discharge page patients, send them home, but still continue to monitor their recovery. And, and how fast will I be seeing this? How fast will I be able to like, will it be like in a couple of months, a couple of years, but I'll be able to go to the doctor and I get this sort of personalized service? Well, in the formation of our new business group, we have actually clustered a number of activities that were already emerging, such as uh, deep analysis mm. of, of data. Uh, we also have an activity to do remote monitoring of patients. We are working with several hospital systems in the United States to help them move patients uh, faster to their mm. home. It saves them cost. It's better for the patient as they sit at home. Um, we see that this is already the year 2014 where this is happening. Right, so of course, we have to scale it up. So if, if I hope not to get sick this year, if I get sick this year, that might happen. Now, Philips, people know it for the, the lighting amongst many other things. You say the lighting is actually part of the source for health. Explain why. Yeah, Philips is, is on a trajectory to become a technology company to improve health and well-being. And we think that can have a huge impact. What we have found through our research is that light will help make people healthier, faster. For example, we put the right light above a patient's bed mm -hmm. in a hospital and we can make the recovery go faster and people go home earlier. Light has a huge impact on how people feel and how their body recovers. Uh, we found that in, 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 uh, in sick patients. We, by the way, we've also found it in uh, psychiatric patients where mm -hmm. light influences the environment where they, where they feel better if we create an environment of safety and comfort. Okay, great stuff. Thank you very much it's for your exciting. time.